Hi everyone, today I am going to show you how to make these super cute teddy bear ear headbands. Now this is a really quick and simple tutorial because the headband comes pre-made and the little petal trio flowers come pre-made as well. And this is a set, all of the sets that you'll see. So all four sets are from the Pretty Petal Shop and I did a massive order back in November last year and got so many different selections of flowers that she does from her range. Um, and I did originally put them within easy reach of me being able to see them but I have so many different versions of the ones that she has. She does lots and lots and lots and lots of different varieties so you could buy them individually and sort out selections yourself and glue them together in a variety that makes sense for you as well but like I said I have tons of her versions and like I said they're so pretty so high quality she uses really lovely quality felt as well so like I said if you want to purchase from there I'll put the link in the description below but like I said you can make your own you can buy from other places it's entirely up to you but I've started this ready here all as well and the other thing that I have and some people might not have seen this before but this is a foot covering to cloth tape and I got this from Aliexpress and I got this whole roll which is two meters and it's the black you know when you ever see these at the tips of the feet this is perfect for this and this was like five just under five pound for a two meter roll from Aliexpress and again I'll put some links in the description box below but it's really useful because what I noticed with these because I also got these from Aliexpress I got a pack of 10 for 10 pound which will be about 11 £7, almost £12 with the 20% tax that you get on things. And I got 10 of these, and like I said, these are the white and the pink versions. What I found with these is the glue at the end here is a little bit rough, and you'll sometimes get like a little, like random here, where the wrap round is of the fur. Like it's not 100% stuck so you sort of can stick, stick that down yourself or you can use tape to sort of wrap it in place and hold it in place which is why I got this kind of tape in the first place. So that is perfect for this and I have a tiny piece cut here already and what I did with my felt because like it's just a piece of felt, standard foam felt, standard felt, I drew around the ear in pencil like so just drew around it and I sort of went in a little bit so it would be hidden behind the actual ear itself and then you can cut that out and I did that twice there we go just cut that out nicely I'm just going to make this just a little bit straighter here and then on the back I actually glued on the headband because you can see the wiring of the headband here and that's why we want our glue to rest so it sticks down nicely I'm going to do it along here we're going to hide that mess that I've just made with my glue blob there your felt back down this is what the front will look like as well and then all you want to do is with your flowers is work out which way you want them to sit I've done them so that the like this flower sort of points upwards but you can twist it around and do whatever you want with it and these come already glued to this really nice quality green felt circle that matches the colour of the petals almost and then you just want to glue that there. and then I gave my little flowers a little fluff up and as you can see got no visible white felt visible there and if you want to you can sort of trim these mind you fur if you have gone a little bit over you 
you can trim them down to make them a little bit less visible. I'm just going to match these up. Try not to catch too much fur when you're doing this. There we go. So, there you go. That is a cute little flower headband and what you teddy bear headband. And with this, it comes pre stuck. Always takes me a second to unpeel it. So, unpeel it. And what I do is when I found that little weird, like little lump, chop that down a little bit. Find the actual end of the headband, which is normally about there. It's normally a little bit down from where the thread is. You want to go up a little bit, just about half a centimetre up. And then wrap round really tight. And I always go around at least once and then pop that together there. Cut that extra off. And then the other thing I do is with my lighter, and the blue clear bit of the flame, I pinch that off so that it's nice finish. And there you go, got two super cute flower headbands. Now these are about £1.50 each and the headbands by themselves are about £1.18 from AliExpress. To buy them in the UK you can find them from about £1.50 to about £2.50 depending on the style, whether or not they're ombre, etc. Things like that. So if you are going to make something like this, even if you make the petals and the flowers individually, you have to look at the costing because this alone is about £6 and that is before profit comes into effect. So if you're going to be selling things like this, you want to be selling them as sort of luxury and higher end and obviously explaining why they are that valuable to customers and why they should pay that much and what like, what you've added to the value to make it worth actually paying those kind of prices so that is something to consider if you're going to be making these and these are going to be for my little nieces and how cute are they like i said you could decorate the back as well and add some flowers and things like that but i think they look quite cute very simple like this so thank you for watching everyone Hopefully you found this useful or found a different uh, way to do this. You could do with this with the bunny ears as well. You just need to do sort of different configuration of the flowers. But I think they look really cute. Really cute. Thanks for watching. Bye.